What's going on Mandalorians? My name is Jesse and welcome to The Forge. In today's video, we're going to be opening up three CCG Select Limited Edition Lightning Boxes. In each box, they contain three booster packs, one oversized card binder, plus oversized card, three lightning cards, plus up to two mystery items. And those contain either a vintage pack, chase packs, coins, cards, so we're going to open these up. They did retail for $33, all right? So in grand total, we spent up to $100 on these mystery boxes. And so we're going to see what we can pull. If y'all could do me the favor, smash the thumbs up button, consider subscribing to The Forge, and then make sure all those bell notifications are on so you don't miss videos like this. And leave a comment down below, would you spend $33 on these mystery boxes? And without further ado, let's get on into it. So here we are, we got our first CCG Select Limited Edition Lightning Box. So we're gonna go ahead and crack this seal and we're gonna move it on over here so we don't peek at what's inside. And like I said, these did go for $33 on eBay. So we're gonna see what kind of items that we can pull from these. Uh, as you saw on the back, they did have three booster packs, the oversized card binder. So they do come with the 25th anniversary oversized card binder. Of course, we already have one of those, so we'll put it out to the side. And then of course, we have our stickers that come with it. And then let's see what our first cards are. So here are the lightning cards that it said it came with. So we have the Raichu, we have the Pikachu, and another Pikachu. So pretty cool, you know, if you're a big Pikachu fan or a Pikachu Evolution line fan. Hey, I suggest these for you. And then of course, here we go, the 25th anniversary coin. And then for our first booster pack, we have none other than celebrations. So we're gonna see if we can get that uh, Charizard from the, uh, what is it called, Classic Collection. So here we go, there's the code card for everyone. And let's take our, oh wait, I don't know the pack trick for this. So here we go. We got Eveltal, we got Cosmog, Lugia and okay it seems fitting we got the Pikachu full art all right let's grab our second booster pack from this box and we have Sun and Moon base set okay so the name of the game would be uh probably the hyper rare Umbreon GX so let's see if we can go ahead and snag a pull from Sun and Moon base set so there's the code card and we'll take our four from the back and you know, rest in peace, fairy energy. All right, we got metal energy, Lilma, Hypno, Trumbeak, Paris, Firo, Litten, Young Goose. We got Surskit, Paris Reverse, and a Bruxish non hollow. Now we're gonna take out our third booster pack, which is okay. We got Chilling Rain. So you already know the name of the game for this set. Any of the alternate art. Galarian Birds. Let's see the code card. Boom. There it is. And then we're going to take our four from the back. And then we're going to go with Psychic. All right, we got the Lucky Leaf Energy. We got Melanie. Expedition Uniform. Hatterim. Scorbunny. Shuppet. Cubfu. Blitzel. Quillfish. Scroll of the Skies. And a Walren Non Hollow. All right, and we're gonna dive into our last mystery item, and it is a graded card. So let's see, okay, it is PSA, it was upside down, and, oh, okay, we have the 2016 Evolutions Pikachu. So, let's look at it. Can't really tell because of the camera quality, but if I had to guess, the centering is way off, so. I wouldn't put this thing past a PSA 9. And okay, there we go, a PSA 9 Pikachu. So that's gonna do it for our first limited edition lightning box. Let's go ahead and jump right into the second one. So here we go, hopping into box number two. So the first box, you know, wasn't too horrible. I feel like we got our value back, 33 bucks. So let's see if we can do the same, if not better, for this next mystery box, all right? So, first thing that we're going to go ahead and grab are going to be, okay, the 25th anniversary sleeves, alright, pretty cool, pretty cool, and then of course, it comes with the oversized binder, 
So there's yet again another one. So probably we're gonna be doing a giveaway in this video because I don't need three oversized binders to see I already have one. And here we go. We got the Pikachu V Union cards. So that's pretty sick. There they are, all four of them. Go ahead, get these right back into their sleeves. And then for our next lightning card, we're gonna have, okay, we have the flying Pikachu V Max. The full art Pikachu and another Pikachu from, I believe that is, what is that, Evolving Skies? Yep, from Evolving Skies, so, all right, pretty cool. Not the best, you know, none of those vintage Pikachus, but hey, it's okay with me. But all right, for our first booster pack, we have none other than Rebel Clash. So the name of this set, I don't even know. Rebel Clash is always good to me. We've said it multiple times here in the Forge, so... Let's see if we can get a rainbow or a full art from this set. So let's take our four from the back, and we're going to go with Psychic. All right, we got Fighting Energy. We got Beware, Speed Energy, Pelipper, Aracuda, Stuffle, Lotad, Growlithe, Roly Coley, Bronzong. Okay, and a Pin Kirchin V. So, like I said, Rubble Clash, always very friendly to us here. So we're going to go in and grab our second booster pack, and it's going to be Darkness Ablaze. Okay, so can we get that Charizard VMAX, the first time ever introduced into the TCG? So let's see if... Alright, that's what it was at. Here we go. Third booster pack, and it's going to be Sword and Shield Base Set. Okay. See if we can't get some of them legendary dogs out of here. All right, here we go. Did they put the code card in backwards? No, they didn't. All right. I hate when they do that, y'all. I hate when they do that. But let's go fighting. Boom. All right, we got the Psychic Energy. Ordinary Rod. We got Bead. Hitmonlee. Cottony. Scorbunny. Silicobra. Yamper. Grookey. We got Goldene Reverse and a Frozmoth Hollow. So here we are, Mandalorians. We are on the third and final lightning box. The second one, not too hot. Probably anywhere in the range of $10 to $12 in value. So, you know, nothing too crazy from there. And like I said, we're only going to be going off the pack sealed and then the contents that came within. So put us around the $10 to $12 range, you know, if not a little higher. But hey, like I said, they were only $33 each, so it's not too big of a loss. So here we go. We're going to hop into our third and final lightning box. Let's see if I can get it open first. All right, so we did get it open. And let's see, can we get something worth redemption? And yet again, here we go. We have the oversized binder. So again, that's numero three. And then, of course, we have, okay, a Detective Pikachu sticker. Then we're going to have some black and yellow dice. Seems fitting. So damage counters and dice. And then let's see what three cards. So first one we see is a Surfing Pikachu VMAX. So let's see what else that we have under here. And it is the same Pikachus from Evolving Skies. <laughs> Nothing crazy, but here we go. All right, so that was probably about like two, three dollars in value. So let's see what our first booster pack's gonna be. Oh boy, we have Pokemon Go, y'all. The newest set that's out right now. And like many of you know, we've been trying to hunt this Mewtwo V alternate art for so long, and we have struck it out every single time. So I'm not gonna have too much hope in today's opening, but hey, you never know. Today could be the day. Let's go with Metal. All right, we got Dark Energy, Charmeleon, Pupitar, Wartortle, Alolan Rattata, Bidoof, Charmander, Apom, Bulbasaur, we got Reverse Lapras, and a Venusaur Hollow. All right, we're reaching in for our second booster pack, and it is, okay, Astral Radiance, so you already know. Let's go Machamp, V Alternate Art Hunting, or Grabbing some of those cards that we still need for our master set. But here we go. There's the code card. Let's see if we can not pull something out of these booster packs other than a full art Pikachu. Here we go. We got Hippo, Curlia, Wait and See Turbo, Sneasel, 
Mistrevis, Barboach, Scyther, Eevee, Reverse, Hisuian Decidueye, and a Hollow Rare Absol. All right, Mandalorians, we're coming down to the last booster pack. If you made it this far, I appreciate it. And if you can consider, if you haven't already, smashing the thumbs up button and subscribing to the channel. And for our third and final booster pack, it's going to be okay. X and Y fates collide. So as you already know, on this channel, we haven't opened up a lot of, you know, X and Y era stuff. So it's pretty cool to see one of these booster packs in here. But there we go. There's the code card. And let's take our three from the back since it is X and Y. And there's no energy guessing. So here we go. We got double colorless energy. Breaks in. Whimsicott. Snubble. Seal. Bronzor. Cottony. Burmy. We got Pokemon Fan Club Reverse and Mandalorians. We're going to be ending on. A Carbink non hollow. All right, Mandalorians, that's going to do it for today's opening. I appreciate y'all spending some time with your boy here in the Forge on this fine Thursday. Hey, we're one day away from the weekend, all right? So if you're having a bad week, hey, we're almost there. It's almost over and we can reset and then we'll go back at it on Monday. All right. So leave a comment down below. Do you think that, you know, it was fairly priced at $33 for these lightning boxes? And, you know, did we kind of get our value back? I'm going to say it wasn't horrible, but then again, it wasn't great. All right. We did pick up a PSA card, but as far as the pools and the lightning cards that they did put in, I don't see it, you know, kind of equating to the value that we spent. But hey, it's all personal opinion. But let me know down in the comment sections. And like we always say on this channel, be sure to tell someone you love them today. And always remember, Mandalorians, this is the way.